Before we go, I just want to ask uh, about President Biden. He is saying he's going to run again in 2024. Will you support him? You know, if the president chooses uh, to run again in 2024, I mean, first of all, I'm focused on winning this majority right now uh, and preserving a majority this year in 2022. So we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. But um, but I think if if the president has a vision, then that's something certainly we're all willing to entertain and examine when the when the time comes. That's not a yes. Yeah, you know, I think uh, we should okay. endorse when we get to it. But I, I, I believe that the president has been doing a very good job uh, so far. And, um, you know, should he run again? I think that I, you know, I think it's it's we'll take a look at it. Okay. <laughs> but Con- right now we need to focus on winning a majority instead of a presidential election. Congresswoman, thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate it. Of course. Thank you so much. All right, guys, you just watched that video. And you know what I loved about that video? Dana Bash, when you look at her face, it looks like someone's shitting her Cheerios. I loved it because AOC wouldn't answer the question. And the reason she won't answer the question is because she might be the one running against Joe Biden and trying to primary his ass to become president of the United States. Not only that, there's other people that put their hat in the rings as well, looks like. People are talking about Bernie Sanders and a few other progressives maybe running for president, like uh, Elizabeth Warren as well. So uh, I think uh, AOC's reaction and then uh, Dana Bash with that face was fantastic. I love this video and uh, uh, it's something that made me laugh because you're seeing what's going on with the progressives and the Democrats. They're starting to have a lot of infighting here. And uh, it's because of how this president is doing in the polls. He's doing awful. And they see that, and it's because the messaging is uh, coming out from uh, the way they want from the media. And AOC, who is known for her media presence, goes out there and gets asked that question. You know, she's laughing because she realizes She cannot answer this question honestly. And she didn't. She lied completely throughout that whole question. And did it well. And made people feel safe and secure that at some point or another, she will support Joe Biden if he becomes a nominee. But there's no definite that she will support him before then. And that's what I loved about it. But guys, check out the video. Share it. Like it. Subscribe. I really appreciate you watching. Peace.